Hello, Fear Meerkat here. Welcome to another episode of Let's Play Silent Hill. Now, I tried to record an episode yesterday. I didn't realise this key was here. And uh, because of that, uh, some areas are marked off as, uh, as red in, on the, the map. Uh, Silent Hill, so if you see the map, that's the reason why, and I couldn't uh, get anywhere. You can go to the police station, and if you do that, there isn't that much to see, but um, there uh, are some uh, bullets uh, you can find there, so. Now, the question is, where is this antique shop? Green Lion. I really wish that this wasn't so blurry. I suppose I'm just going to have to go and look. So yeah, I could see that there's a, an alleyway on the map, that's where I am now, and you can see the police station, I think that's the one that's red uh, there, oh, okay, the antique shop is shown there, alright, well that should be relatively easy to get to. Some, uh, there are some baboon-like enemies in this, uh, this part of the game, and um, this part of Silent Hill, although there are, they are relatively easy to get rid of, you don't need to shoot them, you can just uh, go at them with the pickaxe. Very unsettling music. Has to be said. Uh -huh. Doesn't look that like shirts to me, but These controls really can be awkward. Ah, okay. You apparently need your uh, you apparently need the light on to be able to save. This looks kind of suspicious. What's this? It's a hole in the wall. Harry! Sybil? 
Oh, I'm glad you're okay. I shouldn't have left you. Things are worse than I thought. It's nuts. What are you doing here? I thought you left town. I saw you go in here, so I followed you. I couldn't get out. All the roads out of town are blocked. Cars have completely stopped running. The phones and radios are still out too. What about my daughter? Did you see her? I did see a girl. Was it Cheryl? I only caught a glimpse of her through the fog. I went after her, but she vanished. I don't know about your daughter, but... And you just let her go? Where was it? On Bachman Road. She was heading towards the lake. Now don't get excited. It wasn't like she ran off, exactly. There was no place for her to go. The road has been obliterated. What? So then Cheryl... It was like she was walking on thin air. What about you? Anything? Yeah, I met this bizarre woman. Her name's Dahlia Gillespie. Do you know her? Dahlia Gillespie? No. And? She said something about the town being devoured by darkness. Gibberish like that. Any idea what it means? Darkness devouring the town? Must be on drugs. They sell them to the tourists. The force still can't figure out who's behind it. None of our leads have panned out. And the investigation is stalled. What could drug trafficking have to do with all this? I really don't know. But maybe that's the darkness she was talking about. That's all I can think of. Hmm. What's this? It's a hole. Just discovered it. Maybe there's something back there. Let's have a look. Wait. We don't know what's back there. I'd better check it out first. I'm a cop. I should go. No. I'm going. All right. I'll cover you from here. Be careful. If anything looks fishy, get back here on the double. Okay. Sybil? Yeah? Do you know anything about... Well, like some other world, it's like some kind of bad dream. What are you talking about? I'm not quite sure. I try to make sense of it, but then my mind goes blank. Everything's dark there, and I hear sirens in the distance. I met this nurse, Lisa. It's like I was there but not really. It's all a blur, like some kind of hallucination, you know? I have no idea what you're talking about, Harry. Oh. I was just wondering. Never mind. Harry, you're tired. Yeah, maybe. This is such a brilliant idea. He goes in alone when he doesn't know what's there instead of taking the police officer with him. Well done. And I don't know why the characters repeat what he said and then immediately say, I have no idea. Now, uh, the Lars Hadron Collider? Now I have no idea how that works. 
Okay. Um, I think perhaps it's about that devouring the dark, dark, the darkness devouring the town might have something to do with the monsters that I'm sure you've noticed. What's this? Some kind of altar? Never seen anything like this before. Maybe this is the other church. Ah, this is a sort of um, unofficial, non-Christian, cultish church. I don't know why it says, what's this, when it's obvious what it is. It's an altar, Howie. Is, uh... is there anything I can do with this altar? Oh, that thing on the wall, presumably. Doesn't seem to be anything I can do here. Huh. Oh, there's this. Guess that sign isn't important. Well, let's see how she's doing. Ah, oh, we can't. What the? Ah. Uh. Oh, Harry? Are you okay? Harry? Lisa? Then I'm in the hospital? You were having a bad dream. Was I? Hey, you don't look too good. Are you okay? I'm fine. Nothing you need to worry about. Well, if you're sure. Lisa, do you know a woman named Dahlia Gillespie? Oh yeah, that crazy Gillespie lady. She's kind of famous around here. She never sees anybody, so I don't know that much about her. But I heard her kid died in a fire, and supposedly she's been crazy ever since. Well, she says the town is being devoured by the darkness. Do you have any idea what she's talking about? The town devoured by the darkness. Yes, I think I do. Before this place was turned into a resort, the townspeople here were on the quiet side. Everybody followed some kind of queer religion. Weird occult stuff, black magic, that kind of thing. As young people moved away, the people figured they'd been summoned by the gods. Evidently, things like that used to happen around here all the time. Before the resort, there really wasn't anything else out here. Everyone was so flipped out, you gotta blame it on something. Then a lot of new people came in and everybody clammed up about it. A cult. Last time I heard anything about it was, gosh, years ago. 
when several people connected with developing the town died in accidents. People said it was a curse. Oh, I'm sorry. I'm rambling. I'll shut up. Was that another dream? Did I pass out again? Now, I've got a bad feeling that um, you need to rescue Sybil in order to get the best ending. Yeah, there is uh, more than one ending to this thing. I think that it's possible it's already too late and I should have gone back before examining the altar and uh, seeing if she was okay. But hopefully I'm wrong. If I don't get the best ending, I could at least try to not get the bad ending. Here is that symbol again. Well, I suppose that I can go back to that save point if I want. But I can't do that without um, turning off the recording equipment. So I'm going to carry on with this for now and maybe when I'm just uh, on my own in between recording episodes uh, I will uh, look and see if it's possible. So uh, all of the uh, X's have disappeared, which probably means it is possible to get to Backman Road now. Most of it, if I remember correctly, takes place now in, uh, in the other world. And this is my least favourite section of the game. It all kind of it all kind of looks like this basically I don't think there's anywhere else to go except through here.
TV was subs and lounge here was awful. So I got to map, I'm gonna assume that uh, there's A lot of the Saxons uh, are really short from this point on as well. Okay, guess it decided to leave. I used up more shots than I'm happy with. to shoot that thing.
Look, I'm going to see you in a minute once I've worked out where I'm supposed to go. I have no idea if this is where I'm supposed to be or not. But... I saw Lisa before. I know Lisa comes into the game again. So... You're okay. Thank God you came back. I was scared to be here all alone. I'm here now. I was worried too. I'm real happy to see you. Lisa, can you tell me how to get to the lake? The lake? You take Bachman Road. The road's blocked. Well, that's the only way out there. Are you sure? There's got to be another way. Wait! I just remembered something! What? There's a waterworks over by my old elementary school. It's been abandoned for years. There's an underground tunnel out there used for inspections or something. I remember hearing it runs all the way to the lake. Really? You think I can get to the lake from there? I've never been down in there myself, so I'm not positive. Besides, it's all fenced off to keep people out. If there's a chance, I've got to try. Harry, don't go! I don't want to be alone. It's so scary, I can't stand it. How about coming with me? This may not be the safest place in the world, either. I can't promise you anything, but I'll do my best to protect you. No. Somehow I feel I'm not supposed to leave this place. Oh, Harry. I'm so scared. I'm cold. Look. Just wait here a little longer. I'll be back as soon as I find my daughter. Harry? Now, it seems to me it was fairly stupid of her to tell me how to get there if she doesn't want me to leave. Okay, this episode has been going on for long enough. I will see you next time.